Hey everyone, the video that I'm about to showcase is a re-upload of one of my longer TikToks or Instagram Reels that exceeds YouTube's classification of a YouTube Shorts. So that means it's not going to appear on YouTube Shorts, but it is going to appear in mainstream YouTube. Despite this, this video will remain in a vertical format for your viewing pleasure. I believe the content shared in this video will be equally valuable on this platform as well. Thank you for watching and remember to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more long-form content on this channel. I hope you enjoy. Autism Speaks promotes a mother that wanted to unalive her daughter just because she is autistic. As you guys know, I am autistic. I am very loud and upfront about it. I am proud of who I am. And Autism Speaks is a horrible organization to support if you want to support us. They don't hear our voices and they are overall a detriment to our cause. As you guys know, I've been making this Wednesday video and it's now up on YouTube. Now as I was starting to make connections about it, I feel like I want to draw in that because Autism Speaks made a video in the late 2000s called Autism Every Day. Now you might think at first glance when you hear the title, you might think that this is a documentary talking about our struggles in society, like us autistic adults not being accepted in society. That is not the case because Autism Speaks enlisted parents to talk about their autistic children and they just like downright trash talk them. I get it. Parenting is hard. But to be a parent, you must love your child unconditionally. These parents in the documentary express how they wanted their children to be normal for once in their lives. Autism Speaks promotes these parents' voices, their harmful voices, and I don't believe I want to call them parents at all because they believe autism is a burden that no parent deserves, which is not the case. I made content, I like I make cosplays and online video editing content just to get my talents and voices out there. Like we need to be heard, not just some thing that needs to be ignored or just some big scary monster that Autism Speaks promotes. Then you got the part where you have this mother, Allison Singer, who openly discussed having thoughts of harming her autistic daughter and trying to unalive her by having her and her drive off of a cliff. If this is the message Autism Speaks supports, unaliving our own kind because we grew up with a disability that we are born with, then you are not a good organization to support. Not just that, the mother shouldn't be called a mother. Because like I said, parents love their children unconditionally. If you love your child without autism, that's conditional love and that doesn't make you a parent. It makes you a bad human being. And I'm sorry, you wanted to honor life your daughter because she is autistic? This is drawing so much parallels to parents disowning their kids for being a part of the LGBT community, disowning them then leaving them on the street. If they die, they got blood on their hands. And for the case of here, you wanting to unalive your own daughter, you are not the victim. You're a person that is just downright cruel. Now that we discussed the documentary and these parents, I just wanna go back just to loop around the whole parents promoting how they want their children to be normal. Y'all don't realize this, but society needs them. Autism plays a huge role in society. They bring unique perspectives, talents, and contributions that should be celebrated rather than taken away. And if I made this video talk about how I resonate with the characters on Wednesday and how I chase to be able to work on that show for the second season, still am to be honest because of the SAG strikes being over, then it's quite clear that it's not a burden to society. It's a different way that we view the world. And society needs those viewpoints in order to function correctly. Don't promote an organization, and especially this video where they perpetuate harmful stereotypes of autism. We are not emotionless husks. We are very unique in expressing our emotions. And we, as we can see right here, and this video being posted to YouTube, we have talents. We have unique talents that we can bring to the table. In fact, we need an inclusive society that promotes accommodations and appreciates everyone's strengths. Talent drives the world. Autism is not a burden. It is a stepping stone that society needs and they need to accept us for who we are. 